So the three things that I did anyway which were really joyful for me today was one was I ran, just the most important thing, I ran. So like I was basically crippled, like I hate to use the word crippled but should I use the word, it's basically true, I was very weak and I couldn't run and do almost do anything for thir like 10 years, like 9 years, 8 years and for 13 years it's extremely limited. But this year, is, last year has been the breakthrough of 2015 for me. I made three breakthroughs, relationships, business and career, finance, money and then help. I made a massive improvement, improvement in the last six months and then finally today I started running and I felt the best running just a few, not long to be honest, just a few seconds but I was just feeling it out you know because before when I try and run again and do physical stuff my quads would act up big time and my body would feel like shit like terrible and I had twitching muscles and I just felt exhausted and ruined and wrecked and depleted but now I just felt good, I felt strong, my quads are as strong as they've been They're gaining muscle, I can see them regaining their musculature after being like a lot of muscle mass. My upper body is like getting a lot of definition and uh, even like muscle mass as well from doing handstands. So that's the other thing I did. But then anyway, I have to tell you the feeling of running was off the charts. I felt over the moon and it's funny because it actually is a full moon today. I was looking up at the sky, a very full white moon. Fully, It's fully full today. So the other thing I did was like I've been practicing handstands last year on and, like, and on and off and this year. And I'm like, as I've been rebuilding and strengthening my body, I feel I'm able to like recover faster and do more and do more and do more, you know. I've gotten the ball rolling, I've gotten momentum. And today I did like one, I just got upside down, I was like walking like one, two, three, ooh, cartwheel, back into my feet again. So that felt great. Very, very mild downhill it helped me to keep the momentum forward instead of like falling backwards. So that was really cool. That was on the same walk at night time, going walking at night time out there <laughs> and then the third thing the other thing i did today was it's springtime here in ireland it's like the 23rd of january um so the wild greens and the plants nature's blooming blossoming with the beautiful mother earth and the sun so the other thing i did was i started uh picking wild foods and like wild crafting wild superfood greens for my um my wild crafted superfood green blend which I sell at my shop hireselfherbs.com which you can see below and you can also find my shop through my website ownfox.org which is below but that's great I love that and I, I picked for the first time in my life pine needles and I'm gonna dry them and, and powder them and like along with dandelions, nettle, um, curly dock, flat dock and dandelion flowers, um, that's what I picked today, quite a lot of stuff, especially the dandelions and the pine needles. They're all epic, crazy qu good quality superfoods, way better than like organic. Organic is like lovely, especially if it's grown with love and care, and I love that. But to be honest, like wild foods are like very powerful and superior, uh, undoubtedly, very powerful indeed. And I learned that pine pollen has like, um, an, an abund it's deeply rich in vitamin C and also deeply rich in natural sulfur which is great for many things, but I won't get into that now, but anyway, that's what I just wanted to share with you, my joy, and I hope you enjoyed this video, I'm just talking about stuff that I like, and um, maybe if you feel like you could share what you did today, that you found enriching, soul enriching, life enhancing, and joyful, and I'll see you again in another video, take care, lots of love, abundant, bright blessings to you, see ya.